Hi guys, it's CryptoRocko here and in today's video I'm going to be talking about Binance Coin. If you guys have followed me, you know I'm a massive fan of Binance Coin. I sent out a couple of trading signals on for Binance Coin on Twitter and Instagram. So if you guys followed those trading signals, I'm sure you've made some good money. So before I get into this video guys, I'd just like to take this time to, to thank you all for helping me achieve a thousand subscribers. It really means a lot to me and I'm really grateful to get to a thousand subscribers within less than two months. So thank you all and as promised, I've said when I reach my thousand subscribers I'll do half a Litecoin giveaway so in this video I'll tell you guys exactly how you can win that and when I reached my hundred subscribers I did a, another half a Litecoin giveaway and when I did that I picked a random video and then used YouTube random picker to pick um, the winner for half a Litecoin and few guys complained because I picked a random video so this time I'm confirming that in this video people that comment with their litecoin addresses in this video will win half a litecoin so i'll pick i'll pick uh, i'll release this video and then once i release this video if i get 20 to 30 uh, comments with litecoin addresses and subscribes likes and shares then i'll put the url in this youtube random comment picker so basically copy the url from this video paste it and then the, this this website will pick a random winner. So this is how I'll do it, guys. So to be in to be in with a chance of winning this half a like coin, all you have to do is smash that like button for this video, sub subscribe to my channel, and leave your like coin address below. So if I get about twenty to thirty uh, like coin addresses below, then I'll put it in, in the YouTube random picker website, and then pick one, and then. Uh, it, the the odds of you winning half a litecoin is one in 20 or one in 30 which are fairly good odds so yeah get your friends to leave their litecoin below and then if i have 20 to 30 comments on this video i'll be doing uh, i'll be giving away half a litecoin in this video if i don't if this video is, is not as popular um i'll do the same thing in my next video until i get 10 or 20 20 or 30 address um comments with Litecoin addresses and um, I'm a man of my words guys so once I've got that I'll I'll, I'll give the light, um, half a Litecoin away so let's get into this video so I'm not going to be going into too much technicality of Binance Coin I've done a thorough analysis for Binance Coin before where I talk about the decentralization the coin burns the fiat to crypto and um, um, I can't remember the CEO's name now. I'm a massive fan of the Jiang Chang Peng, the CEO of it. That's the main reason, one of the reasons why I like Binance Coin and what they're trying to do with Binance Exchange. So it's a good long term hold as well. So the title of this video is Is Binance Coin Breaking Away from Bitcoin? If you what if you follow me, guys, I've always talked about that Bitcoin is king and the market follows Bitcoin. So if Bitcoin goes down, market goes down, and if Bitcoin goes up, the market goes up. This is something that has always happened, and this is what you can see in this here as well. So I've picked a couple of coins to illustrate my point. And in the past three months, guys, usually the coins. I mean, Neo's gone up. Neo is actually another coin that I like. Neo's gone up slightly to where it was um, a month ago. The Bitcoin price is the yellow line and um, nem if you see it nem's gone up because today has been a bit of a pump for old coins the past couple of days so this has gone up as well ethereum has gone up but as you can see guys the they really follow the bitcoin price heavily ripple's gone up as well litecoin has actually gone down from where it was but yeah but as you can see guys they very closely follow it but binance coin actually was breaking away from it it's consolidating now it's still up from where it was a month ago but it was breaking away from bitcoin price and so my question is will could binance coin be breaking breaking up massively and um, i was waiting to do to do this video because they had a coin burn recently so i was holding off doing it the coin burn wasn't as successful so it didn't go up uh, it didn't break away but i still think binance in the future is a good long-term hold and if if binance exchange keep doing well and they keep delivering with binance coin this could be breaking away from from Bitcoin and one thing I'd like to say is guys usually um, in, in the past when when the market is crashing or consolidating people try to find another coin to move their Bitcoin from and I think Dogecoin was one of the coins that used to go up when Bitcoin crashed um, Binance I'm not sure whether there are a couple other coins that are similar that we know when Bitcoin goes down people move their money to it to save their Bitcoin and that price goes up and um, Binance was acting like that a couple of times I don't know if it will happen carry on like this 
but there are a couple of coins that, that do that. That's just short term trading and I don't advise short term trading to people that are not experienced with trading. Um, ontology, I didn't want to use this example because ontology has been on a tear up. It's gone up massively um, in the past month. Again, this is something that also uh, one of my favorite coins. And if you watch me and follow me, I've sent out trading signals for ontology before. But ontology has also been breaking away. Um, so it's not just Binance. Um, so I'll see if I can find the trading signals that I put out on Twitter. Might be difficult actually, but yeah, follow me, follow me on Twitter, guys. I, I send out trading signals and just cryptocurrency information and some interesting thoughts as well. And um, there was one, th one thing: how quantum, how quantum computing could wreck havoc in uh, cryptocurrency. This is an interesting article that you guys can follow. So two key articles that I'd like to follow for uh, to show you guys is the coin burn effect. So so Binance Coin had a coin burn on 15th of April and the price actually went down by 2%. Previously when this happened, um, there was a massive price increase. It went up to like 10, uh, went up to like 100% um, previously in the January one. And then also I think they had uh, one in October or February time. Even then the price went up massively. But this time it went down. So I mean, I, I wasn't... I was a bit surprised because usually when there's a coin burn, price goes up. I know there were some news and Binance have been moving to Malta and there's been some negative news in the media. Maybe that had a part to play. But usually when there's a coin burn, the, 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 the supply of coins goes down, demand goes up. It increases scarcity, although a small bit, but it does increase scarcity. So the price goes up. So it talks about it. You know, last time when it happened, it went up by 200%. So it was a bit surprising to see that it didn't go up this time. Maybe this coin burn effect is kind of wearing off, but it didn't go up as much as people um, had, had expected to. But coin, it's still, Binance is still a good, really, really good buy because Binance over. Um, their plan is to buy back 100 million so they'll be down to 100 million coins and that's so your 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 percentage of binance ownership would coin ownership would go up and it will increase demand and scarcity so overall it's still a good buy and the main point why i think binance could be breaking away and it's not just binance <coughs> excuse me it's not just binance it could be other coins as well but it would be through the binance exchange if binance can add more crypto to fiat pairs for Bit Ethereum, Ripple, Litecoin, they're saying maybe um, even Verge, then the dependency of Bitcoin where the price of other coins are dependent wholly on Bitcoin will be a lot less because people can be trading um, directly with fiat. So this will be a massive change and, uh, and I think I hope Binance and um, the CEO of Binance can deliver that and then moving to Malta, if you guys have watched my video or if you guys research about Binance, having moved to Malta is also a massive benefit because Malta could actually help uh, deliver this because Malta is a crypto friendly country. So with their move to Malta and the innovative and very, very, very good CEO, Zhao Changpang, um, I can't pronounce his name, sorry, I don't know if I've got his pronunciation wrong, this could be a really good possibility. I've done my research on Zhao, Zhao Changpang and the way he's gone about it on Twitter, the way he's um, managed the exchange and the communication with the public, which is sometimes a, not the best crypto cryptocurrency. They don't really communicate with the public and the community as much, but he's done it quite well. So if they can deliver on that, guys, Binance could be breaking away from Bitcoin, and they could also be allowing other coins to break away from the Bitcoin dependency. So I hope you guys enjoyed that video, guys. Again, thank you all for helping me achieve a thousand subscribers. It really, really means a lot to me. So thank you very much, guys. And I don't make any money. From, from from YouTube so this half a like coin it might not mean a lot to many people but it means a lot to me and I want to give away as much as I can and, and once I receive my first paycheck from YouTube a couple of months down the line or whenever if I ever re receive it the first paycheck that I get I will give that um, away uh, in cryptocurrencies like coin or, or something else so yeah guys so if you guys um, want the half a like coin guys subscribe to my channel smash that like button share it with your friends and let's see if i can get 30 uh, comments with litecoin addresses and i will be doing a half half a litecoin giveaway in my next video I'm, i've worked really hard in this um, in the past few weeks and months to get to the thousand subscribers so i'm i'm taking a week off i'm on holiday uh, this week so i'll probably be doing the next video in four or five days or in about in about a week's time so thank you very much guys and i'll see you guys soon with another great video